Today we will talk about trading and this will be the contents for anyone who wants to start trading. After this video you will know exactly what you need to learn when you starting out and if, when you want to become a trader. When I started guys and I am actually creating this video exactly because of this reason that when I started out guys I couldn't find something one good video which could explain me or video series or tutorial which you could explain me what trading is and where is exactly where I need to start what I need to study and everything in one place and here you go guys this will be video for you who wants to start trading because I have created this as small as possible I compress it all information put it all together and I have been trading already for five years I am successful in my trading currently and that's why I decided to give back and create a video tutorial for anyone who wants to start learning to trade. In this video let's go through and understand what trading is. First thing is trading is not gambling and you should educate yourself. First three years of my trading I was completely unsuccessful. I was losing lots of money. Uh, obviously there were some winning trades, there were some losing trades but most of them were losing trades and you should understand understand guys that you will never ever be a successful trader if you will not study because all traders are, who are professional traders they have actually done their education and they still educate themselves every day but at the very beginning you should educate yourself because trading is not gambling and once you educate yourself you understand when to take positions how to take positions how to manage your risks but if you haven't done this you will be playing with your money and most likely you will lose it and this is exactly the reason why 90% of people out there are losing their money. I can't even stress it enough guys but you should educate yourself. If you want to drive a car and you have never driven a car you will need to educate yourself to drive that car. If you want to drive a bicycle and you have never driven a bicycle you will need to educate yourself to drive that bicycle. If you will not do this you will most likely crash and this is what happens with 90% of new traders because they haven't educated. And I'm repeating this I know guys I might sound a little bit annoying but I want to I can't stress this guys how much how important it is to educate yourself if you want to start trading otherwise if you put your money on the table you will lose it better send it to me if you don't if you are trading without educating yourself because you will lose your money most likely like 90% of people by statistics are losing their money in trading. So guys now let's jump in and in this video like I mentioned you will understand everything you need to know about trading. So this is the trading tutorial for beginners where in couple of videos I don't know how many videos will be there but I will show you and explain you and will teach you trading basics or pretty much trading not only basics you will know how to trade in financial markets so as cryptocurrency markets Markets, but I will be showing you everything on Bitcoin example. In trading three steps to learn trading. There are only three steps but these steps are bigger we will talk about them also in this video guys. First step is preparation. Second step is education and trading strategy plus trading plan. This is pretty much outcome because each trader has their own trading strategy and each trader has their trading plan and you have to create your trading strategy and trading plan but obviously you will not be able to create your trading strategy and trading plan if you haven't educated yourself. You can ask any trader in the world if you know any successful trader does he has his trading strategy and his trading strategy is written down on paper so as his trading plan is written down to on paper and he follows this trading strategy and his trading plan. So what is trading strategy I will give you a quick insight. So these are different patterns for example or different indicators which trader is following and he takes trade only when this pattern comes through for example this is a breakout in price or this indicator comes through these patterns and indicators are matching and only then trader takes a trade and if you know any successful traders then you should know guys that there is a huge and very rich successful traders which make trades only three to four times a year so ask yourself a question why 
as I do this exactly because they are waiting for trading patterns or trading indicators or their trading strategy and trading plan to be as close to possible to take a trade when you are entering trade it doesn't mean requirements of meet requirements of your trading strategy and trading plan guys most likely you will lose money but we will talk about discipline as well in future videos and here preparation is first education trading strategy and trading plan so trading strategy and trading plan is outcome this is what you will get at the very very end when you will go through education process and will understand charting patterns uh, indicators and what to learn actually because most of you probably who are new to trading you don't even know what to learn where to start and this was my problem when I started to learn trading step one preparation as we talked we have three steps preparation education trading strategy and trading plan so first step is preparation so what is included in preparation is financial instruments and what to trade in preparation if you want to become a trader obviously you want to know what instruments are there what you can trade and under financial instruments we can talk about stocks and stocks is the same as shares so stocks or shares so CFDs, futures, uh, obligations and many more things which you can trade and we will look at them also in the, to different financial instruments in my video so you understand what instruments are there to trade and cryptocurrencies we will talk and like I mentioned I will be basing most this tutorial on Bitcoin trading because me myself I'm currently trading Bitcoin. I this is one of the markets which I, which has a good volatility it has a good volume and i can make successful trades and make lots of money guys and i'm trading futures i will also be showing this in my videos so trading platforms and brokers so you have to choose if you are for example trading stocks or something like that you will need to find the broker what is brokers i will also talk in these videos when we will get there and trading platform whether you want to use a trading platform for example cryptocurrencies guys you can trade on trading platforms you don't need any broker you just need find the trading platform like uh, for example binance and you can start trading different cryptocurrencies without uh, any broker but in financial markets if you are want to trade for example stocks you will need to get a broker and i will show you also brokers in these videos and different different trading platforms which you can use to trade and charting tools each trader has at least one good charting tool which he is using and uh, where he is actually looking for indicators where he is doing his chart analysis and looking for chart patterns and so on and so forth so you should have at least one charting tool and in my videos i will go over trading view and I will show you how trading view will work how, how trading view charting tool works and this is absolutely free and you will be able also to use it straight away after the video and this will be my next video in this video series so if you are interested this will be the next video guys about charting tools and technical trading ta technical analysis so there are two types of trading pretty much or the however uh, most traders follow both of them one uh, type of trading is technical trading ta or technical analysis where you are using indicators where you are using chart uh, chart uh, patterns and so on and so forth and then there is a fundamental trading and fundamental trading it is for example there is a bitcoin and uh, bitcoin fundamentals it could be like idea behind the particular project or technology behind the particular stock and uh, uh, if we talk about bitcoins and bitcoin could be like one fundamental idea why its price could go up is because it will ever be there will, there will ever be only 21 million bitcoin ever created demand and supply controls its price you could think about this but we, i will also create a video on this subject technical trading at TA and fundamental trading what are differences and what you should know about it so first thing from these three steps preparation and now we will get into education so after you have prepared yourself after you know financial instruments you have decided what you are going to trade you know platform and you have chosen a broker and you have chosen a charting tool and you understand now in general what is technical trading and fundamental trading you go into education and education is everything about charting guys and not only 
as you can see point one is emotions and discipline if you will not have these guys you will most likely lose money and most traders exactly lose money because of lack of emotions uh, control of their emotions and discipline for example what uh, here you go guys if you have been trading or if you have been making any trade so most likely you have lost money just because you have just lost one trade and then you jumped into the another trade and this happened because of your emotions not because of, of your trading strategy or trading plan you lost money and this is one of the biggest things how traders and why traders are losing money but we will talk about emotions and discipline also and discipline means that you have to have a discipline to follow your trading strategy and your trading plan if you don't have a discipline you lose money and most people who are in markets they don't have this discipline and that's exactly why there are so many people or 90 percent of traders who lose money firstly they didn't never ever educated themselves this is one thing and secondly they don't even have a trading plan or trading strategy if you are watching this video and you are trading and you are calling yourself a trader for example do you have a trading strategy and trading plan if not you are not a trader you are a gambler because all traders all biggest traders trading firms uh, like uh, companies they have a trading strategy and those people who work in that particular company or firm or a uh, trader who is trading with huge amounts of money millions this could be sometimes billions guys they all have trading strategy and they never take a trade if those circumstances it doesn't meet trading strategy and trading rules but, but we will talk about this in separate video and then second thing what you need to understand is candlesticks or candlestick patterns also and trading indicators there is about 10 to 15,000 different trading indicators which you can use and I will be creating a playlist where I will be reviewing different trading indicators which I have been using and there is lots of them that's why I will be creating a couple of videos describing and explaining different trading indicators which can show you like entry points and that's the purpose of trading indicators pretty much because they allow you to find a good entry point they are showing you whether market is overbought for example or whether market is oversold how big volatility what's the price action currently and so on and so forth we will talk about this also in trading indicators video and then we have chart patterns and this is different chart patterns which charts are drawing you can have a good idea where price will be moving depending on those chart patterns we will talk about this also in one of my future videos so order types trading there is or trading types order types shorting and selling and longing and buying bitcoin longing and buying what does it mean we will also talk trading opening and closing positions i will show you in real account how to open and close positions how to put stop losses how to put uh, take profits and so on and so forth and then we will talk about leverage trading or also known as margin trading and we will talk about risks about this and we about futures because in futures you can also use always leverage guys and then we will talk about risk management and position size which is also very very important and many new traders who are learning trading they don't pay much attention to risk management and position size however this is very 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 important guys you have to know how to how to manage your risks and one thing for example is you never trade with all your accounts you use stop losses if you if you are trading with a huge position in any way because one we can wipe out your account in seconds guys and i am telling you in seconds you can lose all your money if you don't use stop losses for example or if you trade for example with full position and imagine you are not losing using stop losses your account with one week in couple of seconds get wiped out so your trading is over so game over so you have to talk we, we will talk about risk management and position size as well in these videos and chart reading and charting this is already what i mentioned and the uh, trading time frames like five minute uh, one hour uh, two hour and so on and so forth or one day one week one there is different uh, 
trading time frames. But one thing you should know is that each pro professional traders usually use not more than two trading time frames. Me myself, I'm using five minute time frame and I'm using one hour time frame, guys, to make my trades. And rarely I look at one day's time frame as well just to see what is chart drawing and to understand charting and understand what is what is happening with the chart but we will talk about this when we will talk about charts so guys education this is the second thing all these things here you go guys emotions they go over over all these things and you will have a good education on trading so you now you are prepared as you can see we had these three steps preparation then you have education and once you have education and you prepared you know what is financial instruments of different types and you have take, uh, picked your broker and charting tools and so on and so forth and then you educated yourself then we move to trading strategy and here should be also one more thing trading plan which you should have and this should be written down in a written form. So if you have a trading strategy and trading plan, these, these are two papers pretty much which shows you only, only way or only time when you can take a trade or when you can open a position, you can call it however you want. This means when you can press a button on your broker. And if you are not following your trading strategy and trading plan, guys, most likely you will lose all your money. And professionals always follow their trading strategy and each professional has their trading strategy and trading plan. And in these videos, I will show you how you can create your trading strategy and trading plan. And I, we will not start with these two because obviously uh, there's no point because you don't have enough education. You don't as a new trader. I believe that many of you who will be watching this video, you are brand new to trading. You don't really know how to trade and you don't understand what is indicators, what are chart patterns. So we will talk about this all in my videos, guys. So yes, this is pretty much for introduction for this video, guys. And if you found it useful, leave a like, share this video, subscribe to my channel if you are new and see you in my other video.